Theft of strike is looming, prompting concerns of a major transportation mess for commuters at this time next week. The transit union says contract negotiations have stalled. In response, the city and SEPTA are releasing contingency plans and telling riders now is the time to prepare. Action News reporter Corey Davis tells us what's at stake. This possible strike is authorized to start on Wednesday, November 1st, if a deal isn't reached. We know this morning, right now, SEPTA leaders as well as union officials are over at the Wyndham Hotel in Old City. They're locked inside telling us that they're trying to reach a deal. This all together, though, could definitely impact commuters who are trying to get around. It's going to inconvenience the people because some of us live in the surrounding area and we need those quick traffic routes quick step the routes to get us to our employment where we need to be at. I work um, at a veterinary hospital on 2nd and Gerard and that's how I get to work. And I have to be there at 8 in the morning, so getting them early buses, it's a lot. But I also understand the strike. I also understand what the workers need. I wouldn't be able to get to work, but uh, I would drive, though, and park in the Love Garage. So it would be $2 for me to take the bus each way, and it would be $23 for me to park in the Love Garage. SEPTA and the city's Office of Emergency Management issued guidance yesterday in case there's a strike next week. Local TWU 234's contract expires Tuesday night, October 31st at 1159. The strike would start Wednesday. It's the largest bargaining union in SEPTA and represents 5,000 employees. They say their motto is that they move Philadelphia. Well, that could stop next week. Union members have authorized a strike if a deal isn't reached, saying they're working to address how raises, salaries and benefits are handled between managers and members. Also working on safety and security concerns on the transit system. SEPTA officials telling us they've added more police and are continuing to have large recruitment classes at the police academy, but they say the transit agency is limited right now. Here's a look at everything you need to know. If a strike were to occur, the following services would be suspended beginning Wednesday, November 1st. The Market Frankfurt Line, Broad Street and Broad Ridge Spur Lines, City Transit Bus Trolley and Trackless Trolley Routes. The following services would continue to operate if a strike goes into effect. SEPTA Regional Rail Lines, SEPTA Customized Community Transportation Service, Lucy Shuttle Service, Norristown High Speed Line, Trolley Routes 101 and 102, Frontier and Victory Suburban Bus Services. SEPTA and the Transport Union have been negotiating since July, going back and forth, but right now, time is running out. Reporting here in Center City, Corey Davis, Channel 6 Action News.